Hello friends, welcome to Spicy Cat Colors. My name is Kathy. I just received my newest in edition of the Mystery Colors magazine. I do subscribe to it. I will link where I subscribe to it online. You can subscribe through Amazon. I went to their direct website here. I'll just show you. I used one of these vouchers and this is exactly where I went and bought it. So I'm going to put this right here because, so the first time, the first one I received in the mail was the last one was the dinosaurs, which I have not colored in because I'm trying to finish my very first one I bought. And I was super excited because even though it was animals, they did some really fun and funky color schemes. And it was like in a plastic sleeve and mailed to me. So now this one, I'm disappointed because it just came in the mail, which is fine. That's how magazines normally come. But it's got this sticker on and it's like stuck stuck. So I want to pull it off, but I'm probably going to destroy it. And I don't know if I want to keep this, so I thought, well, if I wanted to, like, sell it, or maybe I'll find someone, maybe it'll show up as a um, random giveaway, which, FYI, I do those, but I don't ever let you know it's there. You gotta watch my videos <laughs> and subscribe if you um, want to ever be entered in one. So, I was just, like, wah, wah, not excited when I got this between that, and then I'm like, it's another animal's. Now, when I first discovered Mystery Colors, and there was like that super adorable Christmas one, and then the baby animals, those were cute. I guess they're animals. I'm doing the jungle animals. That was the first one I bought. I'm just getting so tired of brown and green. And American Wildlife, it's probably pretty similar. So, if I'm going to show you a few pages, but it doesn't really show much because they are a mystery, but maybe not so much a mystery. So this one only has 19 colors, which they have different colors as well. And the colors are different than they have been in different books. It would be nice if they had a consistent color key, but um, my markers will run out by the time I do a whole book. So I just have my own method to um, number these. So these aren't I mean, this isn't a mystery. I can tell what animal this is, can't you? Uh, maybe not, because... And then, same with this one. They don't... It's like they're... And they're such little... Look at that little, tiny, tiny bits and pieces. Now, I like to use, like, Crayola Super Tips. I'm going to need to use fine liners or pencil, which will make me not enjoy it even more. And all this whole... Huh, I'm sure there's people that will love this one, but I can tell you every page I'm looking at, I can tell what the animal is. It is not a mystery. This one, no, I can tell, and I don't like this one. I don't like this page. Um, so, I know, complainer, complainer. I'm just like, oh, Danielle, do you want this page? <laughs> um, I'm going to show you the answer key at the end. So if you don't subscribe, uh, I have only found these at Walmart here in the United States. Um, all of these, I can tell basically what the animal is. So not super impressed with the mystery of it. They do give this like fun fact on your left hand side, which is interesting. Seriously, is this a mystery? I mean, I hope it is what I want it to be based on the colors. We'll find out. Um, but I don't know. How long, friends, how long have they been around? Um, you know, this one they tried to, see, where they tried to make it look like here's an eye and a nose, like this is the head. But obviously it's not because here's the rest of the animal. Unless I'm totally... Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I should just shut up and check quick what that one is. But I'm pretty sure. Yeah, no, that's, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> so I don't know if this has been the way they've always been. If this is, you know, are they always so animal heavy? Um, I'm just really, ugh. I'm disappointed. There may be a few pages in here I will do, and then I will either gift it, pass it to a friend, or 
The bad thing is when I look through the color key, there are a couple that I want to do. So then I would feel guilty like using it as a giveaway. But I think if I did it on a video and I said, look here, I did these pages and I will most likely cut them out because I'll want to keep them. And if anybody wants this, well, then they know that's what they're getting. So anyway, now if you don't want to see what the answer key is, go ahead, stop by again later. You still matter to me. But otherwise, I will show you the answer key of what is in this um, magazine. These come out every other month. So let's just zoom in because it's a little easier. So again, you probably saw all of these. Okay, I didn't know it was an elk, but I figured it was a deer of some sort. And because this is American wildlife, they did them, unlike the dinosaurs, which we didn't know for sure what color they were, they could do them all fun. This is the one where I said, I do not like this page. I am not a snake person at all. So I will not be doing that page. Um, but again, we got a lot of blue skies. We got a lot of green. We got a lot of brown. This one's kind of fun. I might want to do. So the, pa the pages that I think I would do is the skunk because he makes me smile. This red squirrel makes me smile and is cute. Okay, maybe I'll do more than I thought. I mean, the eagle is very regal. Um, oh, look, an otter. Where were you two months ago? Uh, otter. The deer. This, okay, it is a monarch. Monarch definitely will be doing that page. That's one that I would want to keep. Um, the bison reminds me of where I was raised. And the next page, what do we got here? A lot of brown animals. A beaver. I like this bear because he's got a fish in his mouth. Um, birds. I just am finishing on a reptile one in my jungle animals. So there you go. It's kind of, I'm not sure about it. Um, I do have this book. I finally just colored in it and I have, they have a second one coming out on Amazon where it's a compilation of some of the uh, magazines and I do have that one pre-ordered. So anyway, if you are interested, I would always rather know again, if you went and saw this in the store, you could look and see what it is, but now you will know if you want to look for it or not. If you have not done any of these mystery colors, they are fun. And I, I mean, if this was the first one you ever bought, you'd probably enjoy it. Kind of like the jungle animals. I was really enjoying it until I'm almost done with it and I'm just tired of it. But um, I'm not that excited about this issue. I just wish they would do something besides animals. I mean, animals are great. I love them. But I just run out. Actually, it doesn't even need to hide my address because it's a P.O. box. <laughs> and I have it listed in my, um, I don't even have to hide it. I have it listed down below anyway, because that's all we have. We don't have home delivery where I live. I only have a P.O. box. So there you go. I just wanted to share this with you if you um, want to be on the lookout for it. I may change my mind and do more of it, but I don't think I would complete all of it which is against the grain of me because I think every book that I buy, I need to complete it because why else did I buy it? But I'm evolving as a colorist and learning. It's also about doing what I enjoy. So there you go. That is my flip through of the latest mystery colors, American Wildlife. Look for it in your, um, again, where all do you find them? I've only found it in Walmart and it's pretty hard. They're usually gone pretty quick. And I don't get to Walmart that often, so maybe they're not gone that quick. I just can't find them. But um, there you go. If you're interested, it should be out. If you subscribe, you probably already received it. If you are interested in subscribing, uh, you can do so on Amazon or on the website I noted. So thanks again, friends, for stopping by. I think you are amazing. And I appreciate you more than you will ever know. There's some glare. But never forget how much you matter to so many people in this world. Thank you, friends.